Hey Royce, do you know Enrivo over here? Uh, wonder if he'll be able to beat my new speed record. Yeah, he's pretty late today. Alright, I'm here guys! Woo! Sorry about the detour. Huh. Royce, you look different. Yeah! Uh, clean my tires for once. No, 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 not just that. Something about... That's because it is! I'm the real Royce Revsley! Who is this guy? Royce! Who is this guy? Then. Uh, I really don't know. Why are you impersonating me? Why are you impersonating me? Well, because I'm the real Rero Cost and the, the proper die cuts, all the detailing and the right shade of blue. Your blue isn't even right. Oh, yeah? Well, your little purple thing here, yours is blue instead of purple. So, ha, you're inaccurate. Well, I'm the official Mattel product, and you're the color changer. Since the guy who's a color changer. Ooh! Burn! Um, guy, how about we both admit that you're both versions of the Revo? No! We need to settle this ourselves. A speed match. Whoever wins is the real Revo cost. Deal! Uh, guys, I don't think that's such a good idea. Alright, let's go. Three, two, one! Under your one, under your one! Ow. Well, I guess that settles it. You both finished the race. First, kind of. That means you're both Revocoth? Is he a... Ow! Well, it doesn't matter because you're both here now. Wait, what? Yep. They tell you, watch out for the speed demon. Wow. That really happened. Hey guy, wanna get a drink now that we're, um, you know, here? Dead? Uh, I'll take that as a yes. See you there! Hello guys, welcome back to another DC Fit Her Cars Diecast Review, and today we've got two cars we're reviewing. Well, the same car, technically. Color Changer Revo Cos, and Normal Revo Cos. Both Revo Cosses. <laughs> um, yeah, this was on clearance, so I thought take advantage of it while I can <laughs> um, but yeah two new cars on the road guys and I'm very happy about it because I don't know why but I could I, I struggled on finding um, Revo before like in like the same place I got um these guys from uh, Kirsten and that you know um, but now I have him and it's you know very good and I now have a colour change that can actually work Before you ask about that, the only other colour changes I have are these guys, and these don't work. These are like old, and I don't know, I played a lot of them in the bath when I was a kid, so the bubbles kind of rip, ripped away, like like all the water. It, it kind of was, it was a bubble bath, so all that, lit, that sort of stuff probably got away the paint and made me see the look at that. The only one that did work was this Finn at Missile, and I made the stupid mistake of putting him in a box near the window ledge, and now he's partly colour faded. Awesome! But hey, it is what it is. Um, <laughs> and now I have a working colour changer, so yeah. So. If you do not know, Revocos was one of the many cars in Cars on the Road where McQueen's a special construction mods, some trucks, I don't know, just talking about all the different provisions in Cars on the Road in the Soulfast episode. And Revo was one of them that was getting worked on. Uh, I think it was special construction. No, no, I'm not, I'm not sure, but it doesn't really matter to me that much. Um, but yeah, here is Revo, both his variants. So, any mini, money, mo, catch fish and let it go. 
Who are we going to pick first? We are going to pick the main one because this is the one that is kind of the most important from a collecting standpoint. So let's unbox him. Revo costs, uh, and the packaging is kind of intact in a way, so I can put this on my um, wall now, except that there's this big, ugly um, clearance sticker on it, so, but yeah, here is um, Revo Cost, and the reason I was complaining about that um, big sticker on it is because it kind of it kind of blocks the character artwork, like as you can see here, and I like when my car's artwork's displayed on my wall, so I don't know. But yeah, here is uh, Revo Cost. Get the character focus. There we go. So, hmm. interesting. Very interesting. So. Revo is one of the many cars in, as I already said, he's one of the big cars in Cars on Road. Um, I don't know why Gister Marshall doesn't have it, but a lot of the Salt Flats cars have like this weird white tyre texture things on them. I, I assume that's to represent Salt, but Salt doesn't do that, um, as T Tall used tie for now. But yeah, this is very, very cool die caster. I I think he's the same mould as Kirsten. Eh, not quite. Missing these details. He is but heavily modified, it seems. Um, yeah. Uh, because look, he's got a very relaxed, kind of cool expression. He's definitely, definitely doesn't have a problem while racing. Um. Of course, there's a faint eyeliner. I really had to get the camera to focus today. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's just a little modification thing on the side, like a special engine. He's painted a solid blue, but as this like black, dark blue that kind of fades into it. Uh, focus. Come on, focus. It's really weird. Um, uh, here's one one five and J one two oh seven one. He's racing with one one five, but that's probably some license plate number. I think it's the same one. Oh, he does another license plate number. Huh. One one five MCL. Maybe that means Michigan. I think, I think Rod Redline had something like that. So yeah, sorry about it. Um, quick cut. Um, but yeah, pretty cool, really. I really like the light blue um, and how the kind of thing fades into it. Um, it's pretty cool. No, you have the exhaust here. I don't think it's uh, so very cool. I really like it. Really nice die cast. Now it's focusing. Now it chooses to focus. Okay. So another guy to add to my salts um, flat collection for the salt flats races very nice but now let's unbox the color changer oh god kind of fell Ugh. get this oh gosh god oh god Ugh. there we go all right so compared to the main version it's pretty similar just the expression mainly. It's definitely lighter. Um Yeah, it's pretty much the same, just um oh the number's smaller. I think there was like a point where the, the colour changes came up before the actual die cast. And everyone was chasing to get him first. I'm not I'm not sure, it's very interesting, but um let's um test him. So here is the colour changing. I did film an other version before this, hence why the change in lighting is later um later in time when I'm filming this. Um but um 
Yeah, I was just really confused and I didn't know how it worked because I haven't color changed in a long time. So, yeah. Um, so, the cold. So, you're going to need like proper cold water, like ice or water. So, you're going to have to have like an ice pack or something in the. Let's make it proper cold. And then you're going to have proper hot water, so as you can see. Color change is just fine in these conditions. So, don't use tap water. I'd recommend don't use it. Um, it does not work. Um, a little custom paint job here. There we go. And then, uh, there we go. Okay, just get custom. There we go. Okay, so here is half Revo Cross. <laughs> very cool, very cool. And I will also figure out that some of the colour changes kind of work. That my old ones. Um, just paste this McQueen in here. Just don't look at using the right one. It kind of works as you can tell, kind of turns to black. Um, I think it's some bleached on this side, so it doesn't really work as well, but it kind of works. It's better than nothing. So, yeah. Yeah, this is going to be a nightmare to edit now because I'm having to cut and uh, refilm and cut and refilm and cut and refilm. It's going to be very nice. Uh, but that is all for this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Uh, and yeah. Say Nara. Bye. Bye bye.